Hello everyone, if you're like me and you've been sitting at your computer for way too long, good idea to have a break and have a stretch. So we should be moving our bodies every half an hour. Um, this is not only good for our mental health, but our physical health as well. So first of all, we'll come back to the chair in a minute. First of all, you're gonna take one hand to a wall and place your hand onto the wall. So my hand's directly out from my shoulder. I'm pushing into the wall with my hand and I'm just gonna turn my body away. I'm just gonna go this way so you can see the action here. Turn away from my hand at the wall. Really good nerve stretch for the shoulder, the arm, the wrist, the hand and the fingers. Especially if we've been over our computer for a while and been doing lots of typing. Hold that for a moment. Walk back into the direction of the wall and change arms. Push your other hand into the wall. My elbow is straight, so I'm just going to hold that straight for a moment and then turn my feet away from my arm. Oh, I can really feel this on my left side. So great stretch for shoulder, arm, wrist, and Hold it a few more breaths. Walk back towards the direction of the wall. Now you can either do this either hands into the wall or using the back of the chair. So you're going to bring your hands to be uh, find where your ribs, lower ribs are, and bring your thumb to your lower ribs. You're then going to extend your hands out directly to touch the wall from there, or put your hands on top of a chair and step your body back to be an L shape. So if you look here, you can see my feet are pushing firmly into the ground below me. I'm drawing up my kneecaps into my front thigh flesh. From my hands all the way to my hips is one long line. And I'm thinking about drawing my shoulders back into the direction of my hips here. So we're not sinking down, we're drawing up our navel. We want one long flat spine here. Or you might be pushing into the wall, creating an L shape with your body pushing into the wall. Look to the chair, walking towards the direction of the chair, and we're gonna to come to sitting. position there. All right, come to sitting. Hands can be just on your knees. Now I'm sitting right, I'll show you sideways. I'm not sitting back in my chair, I'm sitting right at the edge here. All right, so come to sitting right at the edge of your chair. Just take notice of your feet now. Just check that your feet are parallel, facing straight ahead. They're not turned out, turned in, the feet are parallel. So push firmly into the right leg, right foot, and release. Push firmly into the left foot, and release. Push firmly into both feet, and release. Roll your shoulders back, sit up nice and tall. Take the arms overhead. In yoga, we call this Urdhva Hastasana. Now we're going to take our left hand to our right knee, our right hand to the seat of the chair, and we're going into a twist. So we inhale, lengthen the spine up, exhale, twist and turn. Inhale, lengthen the spine up, Exhale and turn. Third time, inhale, lengthen the spine up. Exhale and turn. And then slowly release back to centre. Second side, raise the arms. Can you remember the name of this pose? Urdhva Hastasana. Now take the right hand to the left knee. Left hand behind you. 
Raise the spine, spine up, inhale, exhale and release. Raise the spine, inhale, exhale and release. Inhale, create space in the body, exhale and release. And return back to centre. You can do this last one other sitting. I'm going to do it sitting. Um, or you can also do it standing as well if you want to work the legs. So you can either sitting or standing, interlace your fingers, stretch forward and lift up. Now here, draw your shoulders back towards your hips. Bring the arms down. Now change to the cross that you have to think about. So have that opposite pinky on the bottom. Stretch forward. This has got the wonderful name of Ada Baligaliasana. Stretch up. And release. Great. Um, time for me to get back to work. And I hope your next bit of work is a productive time. Take care. Cheers. Bye.